Traders uh, placed almost £1 billion of bids on a single UK government bond maturing in 2026 as traders dashed to scarce collateral. Guilt scarcity is particularly acute at the short end of the curve where the BOE concentrated its first QT sales yesterday. For more, we're joined by Bloomberg's Lizzie Burden. Lizzie, uh, what does this show then about how the start of QT is going? All plain sailing? <laughs> Seems so. Nothing to see here, Tom. Well, this is a significant moment for central banking history globally because it's the beginning of active gilt sales and uh, it seems to have gone pretty well the markets absorbed this first round uh, and it, the, there does seem to be hunger for secure government debt but we don't know what's going to happen at the long end of the curve uh, that's not the BOE hasn't said how they're going to deal with that yet we might get some more detail uh, at the Bank of England meeting tomorrow we're expecting a 75 basis point hike maybe they'll tell us how they intend tend to deal with the long end because of course they're not going to want to trigger another pensions crisis and that's what happened around the time of the mini budget.